morning. Well, there is progress to keep people safe in the air after the worst hot air balloon crash in history. A new safety bill has passed the U.S. House. Sixteen people died in a 2016 crash in Lockhart, and not long after that, Congressman Lloyd Doggett authored the bill. It requires pilots to get medical certificates for commercial hot air balloon operators. An investigation of the crash showed the pilot was impaired by prescription drugs and should not have been flying. We can't unring the bell. We can't undo the harm that was done that day, but hopefully we can spare families in the future the same horror that the survivors of these victims have endured. The balloon safety bill is included in the FAA's reauthorization bill, which the president is expected to sign into law next week.